10 Championship players who could become free agents this summer. Alan Hutton. It's hard to believe that in 2007, the Scotland right back was linked with a move to Manchester United. Now with Aston Villa, Hutton is looking more likely to be heading to League One than the Champions League. His contract at Villa Park expires in the summer, but I don't think Antonio Valencia is too worried about losing his right back slot at Old Trafford. Number 9 is Michael Mancian. The defender looked set for big things as a Chelsea youngster, but Mancian never quite lived up to the hype and has been with Nottingham Forest since 2014 after a spell in Germany. The 29 year old is probably desperate for his contract to end in the summer with the state Forester in. 8 is Peter Whittingham. Having been with Cardiff since 2007, it seems likely that the midfielder will sign a new contract with the Welsh club. However, there doesn't appear to be a deal in place just yet. At 7, it's Norwich goalkeeper John Ruddy. It's hard to believe that the Canaries stopper actually has an England cap. The last thing of note I can remember him doing was being on Anton Deck, or getting relegated with Norwich either or. At 6, it's Brighton's Dale Stevens. The 27-year-old midfielder's contract at the Amex ends in the summer, but maybe the Seagulls are more concerned with winning the championship than they are contracts. 5 is Derby right-back Cyrus Christie. The Derby right-back is still only 24 years old, and would prove to be a great piece of business if you can get him for nothing. At 4 we've got Newcastle's Johan Gufran. Almost a forgotten man on Tyneside, Gufran has had such a resurgence under Rafael Benitez in the championship and has scored a lot of crucial goals this season. However, it's unlikely he'll get a second crack at the Premier League if Newcastle get promoted. At 3 it's Brentford's Alan Judge. The midfielder nearly signed for Newcastle in the summer, but the Irishman still hasn't played a minute of football this season after a horrific injury. If he can recapture the form he had before he broke his leg, Judge would be a great signing for any championship club and Brentford will be hoping he stays. Number 2 is another Newcastle man, Vernon Anita. Mr Versatile for Newcastle, he's played centre midfield, right midfield, left midfield, right back, left back. If he was a bit taller he'd probably get to play in goal. Newcastle fans will be hoping he signs a new deal at St James's Park. And at number 1 it's Charlie Taylor. The Leeds left back has been linked with an exit from Ellen Road for a long time now and it seems like he's definitely going to get it this summer when his contract expires. There'll be a lot of Premier League teams fighting for his signature, but will Leeds United be one if they go up? Thanks for watching, let us know what you think in the comments below, and don't forget to like, share and subscribe.